Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Funky Steve's Medinas. So we're on our historical figure planet. The planet's called Diefenbaker. If you don't know who Diefenbaker is, um, just type it in. Um, Canadian history historical figure. Pretty cool guy. Uh, anyway, so I'll leave it at that. We're going to go... <laughs> We're going to have a look, quick look at the nav navigation star map here. We made a jump from Electra last episode. Um, we were up here in the, uh, the uh, Pleiades cluster, just in the planet here in the center, Electra. Uh, we made a jump. We're getting a little closer to the flashpoints here. Um, we're at Diefenbaker now. It was a really short jump. It was only 11 days, but it managed to get our mechs up and running. We do have the uh, Jaeger mech back now with double PPCs and the PPC capacitors, so I'm hoping that we can uh, do some good damage output. Um, also, want to get give a bit of congratulations to um, uh, where is she here? Uh, Hellcat managed. To, she's the first person that managed to get uh, Warlord, so that's excellent. Um, so now we've got uh, a mech pilot with Warlord, and I think I'm going to put her in the PPC Hunchback um, just to be able to get that damage a little better. Um, and we'll switch probably either uh, Rocky or Saint to the uh, Disco back. Um, or sorry, to the, to the rave back. Um, but uh, that all aside, um, so we're sitting here and there's, you know, Torian influence on this planet. We've heard from some of the Torians that there's uh, um, a nice manufacturing sort of valley where there's a bunch of plants, like manufacturing plants, storage facilities and stuff that are all controlled by uh, um, Davian interests. So we're going to go down and do some pirating in there. We're going to go hit one of the uh, facilities first and see how much much sea bills we can get out of it. We do need more sea bills. We're okay to the end of the month, but we've got 18 more days. So I figure we can do some good rating here before jumping out of the system. So we're going to go down and hit that up right now. So I'll see you all down on the surface. All right, everyone. Stay frosty. All right, guys. So we're on the surface here. This is the basically the entrance way to the valley. Now, there's mountains on either side of here. Uh, we're going to have to fight our way in. This is actually a military base, so we're going to have to destroy it and uh, make our way in as fast as we can. So let's get on to doing that. Um, really hoping that we don't have too much resistance here. And hopefully the Torian information was correct. I don't want to be going to do this and get nothing out of it, so. On my way. Double time. so this is basically a de base destruction mission. Blow up all the defenders to the valley, make our way in. So hopefully we can just steamroll these guys. I copy. All right. Okay, so that's up on the hill. We want to go down in here, I think. Okay, I got some sensors on. What do we got? Two vehicles and a mech. All right. Don't know how long range these turrets are going to be. I'm estimating this is at about two and a half skull difficulty. All right. Shouldn't be any problem taking care of this though. I love the new initiative system. Um, it's really tough to make uh, predictions based on what you see on the board, who's going to go first or not. You never know if the mech's a heavy mech or an assault or anything. It's awesome. I mean, chances are you know, you have a good idea what it is, but there's, you know, those chances that you just have no idea. Alright, what do we got here? Patent tank. AC-10, lots of armor, lots of armor. Let's hit it with everything if we can. Wow. Okay. Well, you know, I shouldn't expect that. With 25% of the uh, weapons hit, so that's pretty good, I guess. Probably a missile vehicle, yep. So 20. Quick draw. Now, I know we've got quick draw parts. <laughs> I'm laughing if you saw my episodes a little while, like in the middle of last week or so, or toward the end of last week. Uh, Rotec Cold Forged. I thought that uh, those guys had had uh, quick draw parts, but it's not. It's these guys here that do. So On my way. I, I made a complete error. What do we got over here? Hunchback. Ah, it's the SRM version. 
think we want to hit this guy though. Better chances to hit. We want to pull this guy off the map board fast. Okay, half of them hit. Not bad. I'm here. That disco back is really going to come into its own when it can start getting back shots. Once it starts getting back shots, it's going to be like crazy, crazy good. Let's get over here. All right, so let's start it off with Warlord. And let's target this guy straight out. We're not going to bother doing a call shot, but let's just get some good damage on him. Wow, we missed with one of the PPCs. That's crazy. Okay, it's nice being in the water because definitely going to need it on this guy now. Uh, let's fire. So the PPC capacitor is already showing their uh, strength here. 74 damage. Enemy mech. Critical damage it's almost like having a Gauss rifle for 7 tons. 7 tons and 30 heat too though. That's the thing, right? We do have a good Gauss rifle though. Just not inclined to use it. Oh, nice shot. Nice shot. Light damage, Commander. Almost looks like the look, looks like the patent's trying to block the uh, the quick draw there. It's a possibility. Commander. Not enough of a block though. I think we need two quick draw parts and unlikely that we're going to get them from this guy. So uh, I'm going to do a multi-target on this. I'm going to target this guy and this guy. Let's soften up. Well, <sighs> sorry, I've got to think here. Uh, let's reverse this. We'll put the machine guns on A. Maybe we get a head hit and do the heavy damage to B. Okay, we got a crit on the engine. Well, we had to take the shot at it. Warning. Enemy sensor lock detected. Yep. Comes the missiles. Okay, not nice. All right, Steve, let's become a target here. How are we doing on this guy? It was front hits. Well, let's just fire everything into him. Let's get rid of this AC. We can. I miss with one of the PPCs. Really? Okay, well at least he missed with that. Really don't like the rave back, eh? I guess he's just not in the partying mood. Commander? Okay, we're going to move because we I want to get in front of this uh, vehicle. Dump all the stuff into it. All right. Ah, nice. I wasn't actually expecting that, but that's good. I'll take it. Vehicle down. Okay, your hunchback's moving in. Actually, I think this short-range version has got good back armor. I was just thinking that we could attack him from behind with the other uh, with the with the uh, rave back here. But I think he's got good back armor. I think this is the version that does. You'd think, strangely enough, that the AC-20 version would. But this is the supposedly the short range version, so... No, it doesn't. There is a version that does have lousy back armor, but it's not this guy. Uh, let's just move. Let's get right up here. Nice. We only missed with one. Okay, 
I think all around though, armor wise, if you had to be in a medium mech, I think hunchbacks are pretty good overall. Yes, Commander. I don't mind the centurions, but I'm thinking that, you know, if you had to be in a medium mech, hunchback's probably the one you want to be in. It's kind of got good all around everything, except for speed. It's a little slow, but still, 100, 100 armor, eh? We hit the back, we can kill him. Uh, let's just target this guy straight out. Nice. I want to try and minimize our damage here too, so just eliminating these guys as quickly as possible is probably a good idea. Yeah, they do. Deal. It's a lot of fours. Barely hit, Commander. Yeah, more missiles. Okay, we got to get on those turrets. I think the rave back should be able to take this hunchback down next turn. I think that vehicle should die pretty quick too. I think as well with everybody else on it. Oh, they got a tag on me now too. Great. D1. Yeah, he's pretty much toast. Doesn't have much left. Um, he goes on 10, so we got lots of time. Let's keep moving forward. I want you to soften this guy up, please. Everything on him. Orders. Um. How's it? I like them apples. That's a kill. Hear that creak? That's awesome. Whoever did the, whoever's idea it was for those sound effects, kudos, man, because that was the sounds are awesome. All right, dumping everything into the sky. I miss him with those PPCs, man. Don't like that. Orders. Got it. Just getting our stability back. Let's finish this guy up. That should do it, I think, if we hit, which we didn't hit though. <sighs> Such good chances to hit, and they're just given away. Here comes the missiles. At least you sensor lock somebody who had no evasion. Ah, painful. Yes, Commander. Okay, as in the turret, guys. Standard Shredder, AC-20, oh. Let's do this vehicle in. Firing full complement on enemy. Scratch another target. It went before all of us, so... Or before all these turrets, that is, so it's probably better to do that. Um, getting stability back. Target this guy. Okay. What's up, boss? Roger. Um. 150, eh? How much has this guy got left? 60 something. Uh. Let's do this. I'm reading heavy nice. To an enemy we should take this turret down. There we go. Turret destroyed. Yes, Commander. My guess is we won't be able to kill the turret. If we hit with everything, if it's got 200, we will. Uh, let's try it this way. 
This was the laser turret. Great. Okay. That should do it. What? What? I call him bullshit on that one. A hundred and thirty plus seventy eight. Oh, it should have two points left. <laughs> I did miscalculate. So I'm not calling bullshit. I'm calling stupidity on myself. <laughs> it's good, but it's got two points of internal structure left. Sure does. Because why not? Let's get around this side. And a multi target again. All right, C's got 20. Uh, something like that. Wait, C's got 20, right? So that should be B. Okay, here we go. Okay, I got that one. Start on this one. We missed with the PPC again. And again. God damn it. Okay, can you rave up this uh, turret, please? Okay, good start. Should be able to finish that out with Hellcat. No, let's just move. Let's not sprint. Yeah, everything on this guy. I want to make sure it's gone. Okay, is that one gone? It is gone. Yeah, I want to see if you can finish up all three of these buildings here. So this guy only needs 20. This guy needs 142. Now there's too much. Well, we don't. Well, we need all three buildings anyway. So. So the first guy, it's multi-target. Uh, do we have enough? No, we don't really have enough for all three. So the first one needs 20. Let's go with three of these machine guns. B's 142. So there's... That could be enough. Let's try it, why not? It's not gonna hurt. What? Did I mis- I miscalculated. Damn it. That was dumb. I, could do this all day. I don't even know what I was thinking. Oh well. Doesn't matter though. Doesn't matter. Alright guys, we have access to the valley now. Military clear. Everything on this top, on this uh, turret. Still with 90 something percent of chances to hit, we miss with one. I'm receiving you. Let's finish this up, girl. Multi target. A, B. Uh, B, B, B. Yeah. Alright, so we're gonna do that and then Oh my god, we didn't kill it? Really? How much how much did it have? Am I like not mathing tonight? It's probably what's happening. It's yeah, okay. Now we're not bugging out. I'm not mathing tonight, that's what it is. Oh it had two seventy five, so I am mathing, I'm just uh, not looking at how much it had. Alright, fire these, it should probably do it. There we go. Finally. Alright, so Mary, come and get us and we'll move further into the uh, valley. Alright, so we picked up uh, 631,000 off that. And very little damage on our mechs. And I don't think we have this version of the quick draw, but I know we got quick draw parts. So I'm going to grab two of those. Ooh, fusion core. 
Okay, I think we need to take the fusion core and the quick draw parts. Hope for some more. But the fusion core we'll definitely need for the quick draw, so let's confirm that if we get one. So we got four four quick draw parts. Hunchback part. Um yeah, not bad. Huh. Apparently we're entering a restricted area. Withdrawal would be fired upon. Really? Huh. Let's wreck some stuff. You got that right. Alright guys. So we've made our way further into the valley here. Come across this base here. Um, it's a military base unfortunately. So we're going to have to wreck it as much as we can to get through to keep uh, going and pillaging this valley here. So let's do what we can. Not sure how tough this defense is going to be. We may have to retreat from here. Commander. Let's get up ahead here. Roger that. Not picking up any mechs. Not yet, anyway. Yes, Commander. Maybe they're Roger powered that, down. Hmm. This is mysterious. Okay. Standing by. Maybe they just have crazy tough turrets. Reporting oh. Enemy contact. There we go. We got some mechs now and a turret. Don't know how I feel about this. I'm receiving you. Yeah, don't know how I feel about this yet. not moving so this map once again basically using this hill is a great uh, great advantage Roger. All, speed. all right let's see what happens here I've been sensor locked uh-huh Looks like we got hit with an auto cannon. What size, though, and where? Where did we get hit? Oh, torso for 15. Okay, so AC2 probably? Alright, these guys think they can flank us. Can we see both? We can. It's going to put me in sight of the turret, but I think I'll risk that. I want to see what these guys are first. Javelin 11D. Three ER mediums and two medium pulses. And a commando with, like, no armor. Well, this guy's easier than the two to hit, so let's start with this guy. Alright, see what they're doing here. I think that's an assault mech. I would just be guessing though. Ready for orders. All right, rock get the hell out of there. Stay in the woods here. Come on over here. Should be out of the way of that turret, I think. Let's fire on this guy. Uh, leave the flamer on. Why not? Yeah. Punish him. You over here. Let's get rid of these light guys so they're not at our backside. Oh, no PPC hits, eh? Crap. What's up, boss? Just move into here for now. 12, 14, nah. We'll, we'll pass on that. We'll pass on that. Oh, stop it. So that was turret fire before then, probably. Damage minimal. Oh, that's a Thunderbolt launcher. 
QB 20 maybe? 15? We're moving slow this time. Why is that? Just seems we're moving really slow. You better move really far, buddy. Yeah, these guys are fast. Well, I know they're lighter mechs, but still. Oh, right in the groin. Ow! Dude, really? Just gonna pull back here, get behind the hills. Let's dump some stuff into this guy. Um, yeah. Ah, I was hoping we connect with at least one of those two. Okay, so they got a second guy back here over here, over on that side. Commander. Mm, not a bad chance to hit there. What is going on with the lag here? This is crazy. All right, dumping everything into this guy. Yes. Goodbye. One problem solved. Tango down. That guy's minus eight initiative for the rest of his dead life. Dead, unlife, whatever you want to call it. Waiting for order. All right, Rock. Um. Oh, that's a back shot if I've ever seen one. Okay. Going that's track. definitely a back shot. What do we got here? Catapult, K5. That's a lot of missile launchers. All right, let's put some stuff into this guy's backside. Well, we can't move too far, so let's just get up here. Yeah, let's gun this guy. Yeah, I'll fire everything. At least our turns are all fairly close together. Oh, that's a lot of hits. Good shooting, Tex. That's definitely an assault mech. You better miss. Okay. Okay, Rocky goes on 16 this turn? Not bad. Oh, stop. You're just embarrassing yourself. Seriously? It's like these guys are sacrificing themselves to me. They're all like, it's the god of whatever or something or other. We must sacrifice ourselves to them. All right, we're gonna target this guy's backside, dump everything into it. All yeah, okay, good. Standing by. I was hoping he would move someplace where he wouldn't engage, so we can at least just walk over here. On my way. Get our stability back for free, pretty much. Yeah, let's shoot this guy. Fire everything. Critical hit, Commander. I'm here. Okay, no point in getting too far around. Let's attack this guy. Goodbye. All right, Rhino. Uh, I don't like the idea of 
that other guy back there seeing me. We can go to here though. Let's do that. I think we're pretty much hidden from the guy back here. So let's just attack this guy. We'll fire everything. Ah. Head hit? Nope. Stop with your damn deep scans. We're gonna see what that guy is yet? Oh, you can still see us. Wow. Reporting major armor I know. I'm getting out of there, don't worry. This is gonna be time to repair, guys. It's gonna take time away from pulling off our mission down here. They've got a lock on me. I've been sent to lock. They can lock as long as they're not shooting at us. Um, can we get a back shot? We can if we totally move in. It's totally not what we want to do either. I want to try and stay at range from that other guy back there too. I don't want to get too close. Target this guy. Um, let's leave off. Leave off the medium lasers for now. Or the uh, machine guns and one of the medium lasers. And let's just fire the rest. Actually, let's go this route. And fire. Nice. Hmm. Good thing those things are pretty inaccurate. We still took half of them, though, I think. Yeah. Still took half of those. Don't know where the best place to go is. Um. Gonna vigilance, because we're gonna sprint. Here, I think, is probably the best place, I'm thinking. Starting to take some serious armor loss, but I think that's probably the best place to go. We'll fire at this guy with everything. Oh, nice. Head hit. Let's just step forward. Gotta get this guy to switch his targets. We're gonna dump everything straight in this guy's face. Oh, you missed with the thunderbolt. I'm here. Gotta get stable. We'll just move forward a little bit. Still protected. Fire everything on this guy. Actually, let's go Warlord. We're pretty good right now. Um, how's this guy doing here? Um, yeah, I'm just going to shoot. I was thinking about doing a called shot in his torso, but... It's in the, he's in the woods and everything. Okay, he's unsteady. Maybe we got a shot before him next turn. Can he see anybody? Yep. Really? They've got a sensor lock on me. Wow, you can see us from over there? Minimal damage on Guess so. Ready for orders. Maybe we'd be safer back here, I don't know. Guessing. Let's fire on this guy. Everything. Ah, oh, crap. Really? Yes, Commander. Ten four. Something weird's going on with the uh, movement here. Dump everything in this guy. Hopefully, we knock him down. Fire owl ah, gone. Even better. 
All right, we don't want to find out what that other mech is just yet. We're just going to move into here. Can we get eyes on a turret? We can from up here, but that's going to put us in fighting range from everybody, I think. Let's just move into here. And um, we're not going to bother with the with the uh, building. We're just going to uh, lose all our heat. We'll move forward next turn. Warning. Enemy sensor lock detected. That's all they can do right now. All right. Not too bad. LBX something rather. question is do we pull out and attack that mech or do we try and take some turrets out first Order. or both I think we want to go turrets I think first let's drop a thunderbolt in this guy maybe nice Okay, we're going to come around this way. Normally I like to go straight in this way, but we're going to come around this side, I think, this time. Like this. Armored shredder turret. Holy crap, that's a lot of armor. Alright, dumping everything into this guy. Let's get started. Don't think we're up high enough that that guy over there can hit us. I think he's pretty covered, or she's pretty covered. Fire everything on this guy. I copy. Okay, we've done a lot of damage to this guy already. Wow. Okay, that guy must have an improved cockpit or something. He's really spotting us well. Yeah, I know. Oh. Critical hit. Bad one, I think. A really bad one. Okay. Fire this. Engaging multiple targets. I think we're going about this the wrong way. We should have gone after that mech, I think, first. Receiving you. 59 left in the CT. Gotta take this building out now. Okay, almost done. Standing by. Cool. Five left, eh? Let's go this route just so we don't miss it. Affirmative. Okay, we got one building. We should get this turret now. Yep. Okay, good. Last the weapon mount, that sucks. Target destroyed. And the endo steel. We should be able to engage this heavier mech now. Uh no. Let's just move it up to here. I copy. And let's drop a missile into is there a small building here? Large, large, large. Large marge. Put one right here. 
Oh, missed by 3%, eh? Yeah, well. Alright, where's this guy going? I was really hoping he was going to turn our, his back to us. But, can't have everything, I guess. Oh. Marauder 2. Yep. Oh, God, really? Alright, firing on him. At least his sensors are impaired. Hooray for that. Yes, Commander. You cannot engage that Marauder, please. Confirmed. Okay, and let's do... Uh, that. Locking on. Damn it. I'm receiving you. God, I think we gotta start. We gotta start shooting this marauder too. We got no choice. Um, it's our chance here. Pretty damn good. Warlord, confirm that. Dump everything straight into this guy. Start stripping this armor. Okay, we weathered that all right. Waiting for orders. It's going to give us a better chance to hit by walking. So we'll attack this guy with everything and fire. Come on, hit. Damn it. Head hit? No? Yeah. Yeah, a little bit. The shooting guys. Helps when you have a scatter gun though. Order. Acknowledged. Okay. Take a pot shot at this guy from range. Damn. Just wanted a PPC hit. Yes, Commander. Um, stay in the forest here. Move down. Think you're protected mostly, I think, from these guys. Maybe not from this guy. All right, dump everything into this guy again. Roger that. Oh, you gotta hit with those PPCs, guys. I know it's a scary Marauder too, but not that scary. Okay, let's leave off one medium laser, fire the rest. Okay, he's unsteady. It's getting closer. Fire everything on this guy. Hopefully we get a knockdown here. Nice hit. There's a knockdown. Okay, he's injured now. Three or four. Looks like a brand new Marauder 2, too. We're scratching it up, but he's getting pissed off at us. Oh, you still hit, even after getting knocked down, eh? Kudos to you, buddy. Pretty good chances to hit. Gonna move back. I'm gonna leave this off. Do an offensive push on this guy. Gonna try for a headshot and fire. Maybe we get lucky with the machine guns. 
Yep. Waiting for orders. Let's make sure you stay in the woods. All right. And offensive push on this guy's head. Fire everything. All right. Oh yeah. Okay, we gotta make sure this guy can't see you, Rocky, so just stay way back here. And let's just fire on this guy. Rarely got a good chance to hit, so I might as well just fire. Make him a little bit unstable, hopefully. Okay, PPC hit, nice. Unstable, all we gotta do is knock his ass down now. Yes, Commander. Alright, Rhino. Um, let's get in here. Roger that. Get our stability back. Now the question is, do we do a called shot for the head? Or do we just hopefully... Well, we should knock him down, I think, if we just hit him with everything. So let's do that. There he goes. That should be it. Maximizing salvage. He is out. Nice. Two turrets left. Alright, we gotta help this Victor out. Can I actually get anywhere I can see those turrets though? Oh, right here. How much does this guy got? 450, really? Well, fire everything into it. We got two rounds of machine gun fire left. Waiting for orders. Can we hit that turret directly anywhere? Does not look like it. All right. Well, we're gonna multi. Can we even hit it indirectly? Oh yeah, we can. Yeah, we're gonna multi-target. Eh, no we're not, because we don't have multi-target. We're just gonna fire on this guy, though. I'm receiving you. God, there's like nowhere to see this turret? Here we go. All right. Dump everything straight into this guy, fire. Is that enough? Not quite enough yet. Commander. We'll be in a second though. Moving to position. Seven points left, eh? Let's multi-target then. Building, turret, and building, turret, 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 and fire. It's overkill, but let's make sure we get it. There we go. No way, man. We gotta get this last turret. Yeah, they can't see us. And I can't... Oh, I can see him, though. I can see you. I see you. Alright, open up on him with everything. That's the last machine gun rounds. Alright, we got out locked. We got off lucky here with Rocky. That CT hit was devastating. Standing by. She's still helping out though here. Alright, let's get over here. Warlord, fire everything. Nice, there it is folks. All right, so Mary's going to land with the Leopard, extract what we could from the base. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to affect repairs here and then keep moving down the valley. So we'll have to pull out the, the MML Hunchback and bring in the other one, the uh, Razor or uh, Raveback, because this guy's going to need a lot of repairs now. 
All right, so we got catapult parts. We have Marauder 2 parts, which I don't think I have any of. Ah, it's a shame. What else do we have done here? We lost Endo Steel. Um, big PPCs. We lost Endo Steel, so let's take one of those. Exchanger is a definite. Yep. And then, oh, look at all the stuff here, though, man. Heat banks. Double heat sinks. Anything else good down here? Look at this. TTS energies. Ah, uh, man. As much as I want those Marauder 2 parts, we can really benefit from these guys. Ah, uh, man. Case 2 as well. We're, we're bound to get Marauder 2 parts regardless, I think. Uh, I know we've got a few of these guys. I'm going to... We don't have... We have 0, 0, and 0. This gives us 10% increase. And I don't think we just have straight TTS. So we'll take one of these as well, because we can put these all together into one mech, so we're going to put this in as well. I think probably all three of these were in the uh, Marauder. Um, so let's take these. I think that's pretty good. We get the Ender Steel back. We don't have any... We have one left over. Do we want it then? Because we can replace the one that we already have, so there's no point in taking it. This heat bank is really nice too, right? Uh, maybe we take that last TTS... I could just totally build an energy build in the uh, Jager mech. Like imagine four ER PPCs. Or four PPCs. Could do that. That's a possibility. Two additional heat sinks, eh? That's kind of cool to have these the e-cooling systems, because then if your mech is full, and you drop one of these in, it's still the same weight as two heat sinks, but it frees up the slots in in your uh, in your mech to be able to put other stuff in. So that's kind of cool to have this. Um, but we'll leave it for now. Let's confirm this. All right, one, two catapult pieces. Oh, we got two marauder pieces. Okay, javelin commando. We got one of the medium lasers, one of the PPCs, nice. Probably heat sink. Double cooling, minus 10% weapon. Oh my god, that's awesome. Maximum. That's amazing. Okay, that's definitely going to be going into the uh, Jager mech. We're going to go for a big build here, I think. Let's continue this. All right, so we're going to end the episode here at 95,000 in repairs. So we will have to repair our mechs on the ground. And when we come back next time, um, we will be going further into the valley, hopefully taking out um, some factories with a lot less, uh, or buildings or whatever is there, warehouses with a lot less defenders. Um, wasn't expecting that Marauder 2 there, but, uh, you know, we managed to clear them out, get some good stuff. So when we come back next time, we'll continue along that vein. So... Until next time, if you, like the if you like the episode, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. Please leave some comments down below because I always enjoy comments. And until next time, we'll see you later.